Hi, uh, Mr. Hawthorne here, signing on with yet another Beyblade unboxing. Uh, today we will be unboxing the Pirate Orochi, a stamina type. Um, this one's a little different than the rest in the fact that if you didn't see it, um, you'll get to see it in a second. And I'll be sure to specifically show that off. Okay, good. The ripcord's still here. <laughs> but I lost it. Um, uh, packaging. Gotta stay clean, guys. Instructions? Don't need them. Um, so, here is what makes this so different. The warrior wheel, the metal blade piece, the metal piece, is colored. It's a nice bright blue. It's a really nice color. I mean, it's not hard on the eyes at all. Like, typically when they, they airbrush these and paint them, it turns out really, really bad, and it just doesn't look good. This? This looks amazing. Like, I mean, look at that. It's blue. Anyways, here's the uh, element ring. Nothing too special there. Alright. I'm going to do this in a little bit of a different order than the previous videos, since, you know, time and me being a lazy bugger that I am. I'm going to put it together and show off everything as one piece. Alright. So... The pieces that are on this are the Orochi Warrior Wheel, the Pirate Elemental Wheel. So, as you can tell, there's elemental stuff involved. It has the Spin Track 145. Um, it's pretty versatile, but really simple. I mean, there's nothing to this. I mean,. I wish I could say there was a little bit of something to the spin track on this thing, but there's really not. Um, it does have a defense performance tip. Literally, the title of this tip is defense. I don't, I don't get it. I really don't. And uh, let's just put this together. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Things are not working as they should be. Alright, and whoops, put it on upside down, at least my personal opinion. Alright, let's see how this goes. And as always, you'll get to see this thing in action on the day that I hang out with my buddy and we mess around with these things. And as always, tools your favorite friend. Don't lose these. Well, if you do intend on having multiple, <laughs> uh, you can lose all but one of them. Uh, just make sure everything gets nice and tight. There we go. The Pirate Orochi. This one looks pretty damn awesome because it's got, like, nice... It's, it's all colored. It looks amazing. Now, on to the launch and ripcord. You got a gray ripcord and a nice bright blue launcher. Nothing too special. Um, I'll go over the anime information in just a second after I put this all together. Here we go. And then, here we go. Um... The, it's a stamina type Beyblade, as has been said. Water element. Um, the owner of it is 8 Unabara. Brother to Kate Unabara, I think. I'm just going to double check that. Uh, yeah, Kate Unabara's younger brother. Mm. Um, a first appearance in the anime is intensive training of hell. 
Intuitive name. <laughs> the manga debut, however, is Metal Fight Beyblade Zero G. I'm gonna have to start reading these things at this point. Chapter two. Nah. Um. Anyways, uh, this is probably in an aesthetic appeal. I'd say this is my favorite Beyblade so far, out of all six. Uh, the color scheme really nice. The 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 pieces fit together really nice. Like the this is probably the most solid one. Uh, the only complaint that I have about this is let me see if I can't find it here. As it hits, the paint will chip off. But it's Beyblades. They're spinning at, like, really, really fast. What else can you expect? That's that's my only complaint about this. Yeah. Um. Yeah, uh, bright blue, blue tool, by the way. Um. That's about it for this one. I mean, I just... I'm kind of burning through the information. <laughs> um, yeah, that's that's about it. Uh, if I made you smile, good. If not, meh. Maybe another video. Um, if you enjoyed this video, check out some others. If you didn't, maybe you'll find one of my other videos was more to your liking. Uh, thank you for watching. This is Mr. Hawthorne, signing off.